Cotton production began in South Africa's Western Cape as early as 1690. It reached its peak in the 1860s to 1870s when it was farmed in the Western Cape and Wazulu Natal. In the 1920s, the first ginary was established in Babaton in Pumalanga and it was officially declared an agricultural crop in 1939. Around the late 1960s, about 80% of cotton came from irrigation farms near Lusko, Vauhat and Uppington. South Africa's largest ginery is Losko Cotton Gin near Mapuhou in Limpopo. Cotton farming in South Africa is a summer crop. It is planted from October to the end of November and harvested in May and June. Planting time depends on the region, climate, soil temperature and rainfall in the area. These assets were sold to a company that transports mainly cotton. After harvesting, cotton needs to be transported and intelligent transporters transport it because most of us follow the noise. We need to be strategic thinkers and follow the product. 90% of transporters run after coal contracts. 5% go after container contracts. So I'm saying to new transporters, follow the trail, follow a certain product or raw materials and see how you can colonize a certain product and become the master of transporting it. Being strategic, will save you and your business. Young Africans will create monopolies in a decade. Mark my words, the train of winners is moving very fast. It's FWM, Kamatlangu, a billionaire in the making. I thank you.